Hawks. Could be good. They didn't have an untapped land. Now, do we win? They probably have another Tefri's protection, but we can... Oh, no, they don't. Hello, my fair citizen. Strider, the mayor of Sodium City here, and I have yet another land destruction deck for you. This time, we're using Faithbound Judge for the finisher and Fall of the Thran for land destruction. Faithbound Judge is a three mana 4-4 four, four with Defender Flying and Vigilance. And at the beginning of your upkeep, if Faithbound Judge has two or fewer judgment counters on it, you get to put another judgment counter on it. As long as Faithbound Judge has three or more judgment counters on it, it can attack as though it didn't have Defender. There are a couple things to note here because of that. First of all, it's a 4-4 Flyer for three mana. That's the most important part because it's an amazing blocker as soon as it enters the battlefield. This is also amazing for putting pressure on Planeswalkers after a few turns. You know, because later on in the game, if they put down a Tefra, or some other five or six mana creature if they aren't actually able to deal with the judge that's good for us because we usually are able to kill the planeswalker because attacking for four loyalty quite a lot but if they are able to kill the judge that's when we actually get happy smiley face faithbound judge does have a backside that says enchant player at the beginning of your upkeep put a judgment counter on sinner's judgment so it's basically the same as the front side then, if there are three or more judgment counters on it, Enchanted Player loses the game. It's like an alternate win con. It's pretty sweet. If Sinner's Judgment would be put into the graveyard from anywhere, exile instead. Whatever, it's irrelevant. The bad part about this is that it's a disturbed cost of seven mana, which means that you have to have it in your graveyard and it costs seven mana to cast it. The good part about this is that we can use board wipes and not feel bad. There is a way that we can add an additional counter to Sinner's Judgment. This makes sure that we only need to have it survive for two turns instead of three, which is actually pretty relevant. So we're going to do that using cards like Lithoform Engine. This is one of my favorite cards. It's just a four mana artifact that does quite a few things, but really just gonna focus on the two mana tap, copy target activated or triggered ability you control. You may choose new targets for the copy. So basically on our upkeep, we're just gonna copy the activated ability and put two counters on it. And then next turn, it puts third counter on it, and then we win. Simple as that. And for our land destruction, we are using Fall of the Thran, so that when it comes into play, we are going to destroy all lands. This does include our own, but then the next two turns, each player is going to return two lands from their graveyard to the battlefield. And obviously, we want to avoid them bringing back any lands whatsoever, so we're going to exile their graveyard by using Soul Guide Lantern. This is just a one mana artifact that has the ability to tap it, sacrifice it to exile all opponents' graveyards. This is exactly what we need. We can also use that same two man ability from Lithoform Engine to copy the returning of lands in order to get four lands into the battlefield instead of two, which can be very relevant. Now, I will dare you to play this deck. It definitely wasn't the greatest, but I do love Sinner's Judgment, so I had fun regardless. If you were going to play this deck, it will set you back 40 rares and 5 mythics, so that's exactly why I will not recommend it. Unless you already have all the cards, or planning on changing it a lot. Just saying. But, if you would like the current deck list, you can click on that card that pops out at the top right hand corner of this video. It will take you on over to the Aether Hub page, but if you want the text based version, that will be in the description below as well as another link to the Aether Hub page. Stay salty, and enjoy the games. What up, Chris? Uh, why? I don't really need another one. How much, man? Just chilling you. Same. Same. All right, do you kill it? All right. Crushing our enemies? No. We've been fucking around too much. Would you like to pay four for that?
Would you like to pay four for that? <laughs> Wait, opponent come back. <laughs> we could make a filthy tax deck nowadays. <clears throat> Especially with that 1-1 one, one double strike, dude. Yeah, Esper Sentinel and then that 1-1 one, one double strike. And then Talia. And then fucking Strict Proctor. There's a lot of stuff. You can fucking abuse the shit out of people. All right, come on, one more land. Uh... It's pretty much the same. Pretty much the same regardless. Gross. <laughs> Alright. Silvers are so cool, but weak and historic. Definitely not great. Good top deck. Aether Vial, they're pretty nice. still play compass and use it next turn sure <laughs> oh and it comes into play tapped that's fucked up <laughs> okay okay that's actually fucked hilarious Okay, I didn't know that. I didn't know that. I didn't know they came into play tap. That's funny. Yeah. Alright. Sweet. It's not a sliver. Sure it is. <laughs> I think I... I think I hit my own f judge with this. No. I, I kind of wanted to, just so I could have the clue. Three, four, five, six, seven. All right. Okay. It's not a bad turn. Coco. Oh.
be a shame if my blast zone was on two, right? <laughs> Coco slivers, this could be a thing. I mean, all these things are two mana. Didn't I just bottom this? Sure. I win next turn. Yep. Good old scry bug. Nice haste, bruh. Nice. You got your baited. You got, you got your baited. You got your baited. Zombie wave. <laughs> Wu-Tang Riz said he was rich. He meant to type rich. And then it just evolved into Irish, question mark? Hey, I'm Irish. Does that count? Maybe. I don't know. I don't know if that actually counts. All I need is one more land. Right? Right? One more land land yeah actually i don't know i've never i've never actually i've never asked i've never asked a european so if you're if you were born and raised in murka but you have like irish or french or italian like heritage are you still like, just american or can you from that point be like something. I don't. I don't know how you guys view it. Just American. Got it. I don't. It actually doesn't really matter to me. But because fuck us, dude. I love being American. What are you talking about? Irish, Scottish. I want the beer, but don't want to pay for it. I believe it. If I had a regular land. That's fine. Yeah, but they don't really have many ETB stuffs, right? Maybe they do? Settle the wreckage and to fall the Thran. That's looking a lot less good. It's looking a lot less good. You got your baited. You got, you got your baited. You got your baited. Doesn't do anything for me. 
Because they can't bring back my lotus fields. Fuck. Untap. Yes. Exactly what I wanted. Just don't play any card. <laughs> don't play. Okay. All right, we good. We good. Uh-huh. Cool, cool. All right, I like it. Yeah, sure. I mean, this is pretty good. All right, hold on. On tap. White, white. Resolve. Boom, boom. Resolve. Boom, boom. And then do that. And then bring back that one and that one. White. And then we scry this time. Yeah. Okay. We... <laughs> we have successfully kind of ramped-ish. It's perfect. You know what? Yeah, let's thin out the deck. All right, that was pretty good. I think that was five head. I think I five headed that. All right. Don't need any more lands. I like to oh just in case I get a doom scar I want to be able to foretell it great card all right whatever yeah Is this whenever it attacks? Okay. Probably fine. Why? Why you gotta be like this? Scry. I don't really want another one right now. Compass token, just continue to search for lands without transforming. Yeah. Which is fantastic. It's kind of gas. Yeah, it's definitely pretty nice. There it is. I also meant to do that. Sure. Maybe I just... Maybe I just copy my Fateful Absence. Do 
Too late now. Too late now. Works with Primal Amulet? Yeah, but it's kind of shitty with Primal... Wait, what, what happened? But you still had two lands. I was... I gave you three things of card draw. But I gave you three things of card draw. What's wrong with you? I was being nice. All right. Ridiculous. Ridiculous. Need to use engine more often. Yeah. Engine... Lithoform engine is just so fucking good. Zombie wave. Hello. What? I will scry. Absolutely. Pony jank frustration keyboard smash equals wing con. I hope so. All right. I need a lotus field off the top. That would be Gur 8. Did you leave my compass alone? What are you doing? Leave it alone. Leave Brittany alone. <gasps> Please. Pony, knock it off. Stop it. Why do you have a 100 card deck? That is the next question. This motherfucker. It's fine. I got another one, bitch. And what? And what? I actually might compass. This isn't very nice. I hope you banishing light. Motherfucker. Huh. White. Uh, yeah. You can keep that. All right. Okay, this is fine. Oh my gosh, okay, how do you say your name? We're calling you game four. <laughs> Die, fucker. Where'd I get the neon sign from? Uh, it was a place in Tempe, Arizona. I forgot the name of it. Exactly. I can get you the name if you're interested. I might have to take out Compass, to be honest, because Compass does die to follow the Thran, and then I can't get it back. I just really like Compass. Very much, please. It was also very expensive. Keep that in mind. So if you're looking to buy one... Stop looking at it. What are you doing? Motherfucker. I should have just played the Proctor. What? Why am I getting all these lands?
I have to kill this, right? Turn for the card draw. Um, eh. that's four mana, that's four mana. I mean, thanks for the extra value. take that I suppose I'll take that I'm hovering over it. Like I did it I like I did it on accident. Kappa. We're debating. So that is how you debate. They think that we fucked up. All right, all right. All rise, motherfucker. You got debated. You Maybe got I should have just let them you have the two one ones. What up, Sonny? Happy New Year. Happy New Year, Sonny. Soul Warden. Auto pay. Maybe I should have kept that. I went down to two fall the Thrans. God damn it. You have three? Motherfucker. There it is. There it is. Nah, you're good. Nah, you're good. Oh. Okay, maybe, maybe that was bad. Oh. 
I was going to follow the Thran, but... I guess I can't really at all anymore. Compass and follow. Welcome to the stream, Stens. We talked about this already. So I don't know if I like it because of that. Well, this is very bad. Oh, triomes? Why the fuck would I use triomes? What up, Dolwyn? That was a mistake, by the way. Jesus. Six, twelve, I mean, I'm dead, right? Yeah, it's because I, it's because I let them get back the warrior. I, like, I was gonna follow the Thran, and then I was just like, I just, you know, it was just stupid. It's two E's, one P, Nexus. There you go. <laughs> two points profit, poggers. Come on, Arena, one side. Maybe something like Marionette Master. Marionette Master is sweet. Absolutely. I love Marionette Master. Uh... Zombie wave. What's happening? Well, I could definitely lose to whatever the fuck they're doing, if they're doing shrines. All right, gaining two, gaining two, gaining two. It's magic. Oh, oh, it's magic, you know. I mean, just in case they blow up the board, right? Just in case, in, not this turn, but next turn. This is probably a Doom Scar, right? I would assume. You want to pay for that? Uh, do you want to pay for that? Okay, it's not Doom Scar. This is great. 
Maybe I'll just beat their dick off with this Faithbound Judge. You know what I'm saying? No. Leave Brittany alone. What is happening? You bet 1.9k to get 2.4k points in return? Stonks, I guess? Yep. You get points based on... Rude. White. Wait, full control. All right. Okay. Just in case. Just in case. Three, four, five, six, seven. So hopefully they kill it and we can just cast it, right? If they blow up both of our Cosmos Elixirs, which would be hilarious, I'd just be like, brought back. Brought back. Oh, fuck me in the balls. Well, <laughs> didn't see that one coming. <sighs> This is so bad. Doing brought back doesn't necessarily do anything. GG'd. Oh yeah, I could have blast zoned. Yeah, Lich's mastery. Okay. That just flat out kills me. Yeah, I can't do that. That's, that just like legitimately kills me. Mm -hmm. I mean, Mizzix Mastery, Lich's deck. That white card that brings everything back. Oh, fuck. Well, I should have just not done that. Wonderful. 
Yeah, I don't. I can't even blast them now. Fuck. Fuck. We can scry. I guess just blast zone. Um, just get some counter on it, I guess. Yeah, I have to blast zone their Lich's mastery. Can't lose the game. No, not the nine lives, the Lich's Mastery. But the Blast on the Lich's Mastery, not the nine lives. Yeah. However, they might draw themselves out before they can get the mana. Lich prevent losing. I know, that's why I have to get the Lich's Mastery. What do you, I've said it. They can't, I know. They may not have enough land left. That's what I'm saying. Sack Blastome before Chapter 3 resolves? I... I can't. I needed to kill the Lich's Mastery. They have to discard like their entire hand. They'll pitch all their lands, bring back fall. That that's true, actually. I didn't even think about that. I should have brought back Soul Guide Lantern. Fuck. That's bad. That's bad. I'm sure they do. But if discard now when they didn't before, they had Reliquary Tower out. Reliquary Tower makes it so you don't have a maximum hand size. Maybe they'll just rope up. No, they, they had to discard fucking 23 cards. Are you kidding me? They're not roping. Okay. One, two. Uh, see, they had that. That's what they had. I wish I could just fucking kill this. They win next turn. I have two lanterns left. Yeah.
if they get if they get non basics out of this right now that's ideal Three, four, five. Okay. Wait, how are they winning? Winning? You're not getting the combo. I mean, the approach of the second sun. Oh my god! I should just fucking played. Fucking lost. Daddy, chill. I just fucking lost. Oh my god. Needed one turn. It's because I wasted a turn killing the Warlock class the first time. Oh wait. They didn't have an untapped land? Could be good. They didn't have an untapped land. Now do we win? They probably have another Tefri's protection, but we can... Oh, no, they don't. Thought it would have came in untapped because of the Proctor. No, it's just the life gain. At the end of the day, this deck went 6-5, and five, and it didn't really seem like we had any strong matchups. We lost against Mono Brown, Azorius Control, Mono White Aggro, the Veto Combo, Gruel Stompy. So it's like, I mean, we lost against everything. It was like Super Friends, Control, Aggro, Midrange, and Combo decks. We did win against Orzov Lich Combo, a weird Nia Land Destruction deck, Mono White Control, Orzov Life Gain, and Slivers. So we also beat basically everything except a traditional counterspell deck. I just don't think that it's as strong as I want it to be, so I personally would not recommend this deck, but it was pretty fun to play. I mean, blowing up all lands and winning with Judge is always a win in my book. And as for last video's comment question of the day, I asked you, do you want to see me rebuild old decks like you did in that video? Here are your answers. And if you want your comment to show up in these videos, make sure that you answer the comment question of the day in every single video in the comment section below. Thank you all so much for watching. If you made it to this point, it means you either really enjoyed the video or you fell asleep and I'm waking you up now. <laughs> either way, thank you for all the support. I really do appreciate it. If you want to see more videos like this, hit that subscribe button, hit the bell notification, come out with videos seven days a week.